Yeah, I think as we go through uh, the early evening hours, it's going to be dry, but then after dinner time tonight, that's when we'll see more of those isolated uh, to scattered snow showers kind of develop out of Missouri and push into Iowa. It is a cloudy sky, as Alex mentioned, across northern Iowa into central portions of the state and then back down into southern Iowa here uh, for your Friday afternoon. Temperatures again are on the cooler side here as we head into the afternoon hours. We're sitting in the low 30s, right around 34 in Ankeny, 32 up in Granger mid 30s out towards Altoona and Pleasant Hill as well as Carlisle. I think highs today stay in the mid. Maybe some of us in the upper 30s here as we head into the afternoon. Next 12 hours, we'll look at a wind chill feeling like the low 30s for much of the day. Then the wind chill value here, that lower line that you see drops back into the mid 20s by midnight or so. Air temperatures falling into the low 30s right around freezing towards 8 and 9 o'clock tonight and that's when we'll see that potential for some light snow after the sun sets this evening into the overnight hours tonight. This is what it looks like as far as winds they are out of the south and east sustained here anywhere between about 5 to 10 miles per hour for central and southern portions of the state a little bit stronger across northern Iowa this afternoon. Future cast looks like this. We've got a front coming through later on tonight into tomorrow morning. That will bring a few light snow showers around late tonight and the start of the day tomorrow. A little bit of a break by sunrise on Saturday. That front continues to push through the state. But notice more snow showers develop by tomorrow late afternoon and early evening. That's mainly across northern Iowa. So some late day snow potential there Saturday afternoon and evening. The snow fizzles out, so does the cloud cover. We're back to maybe some sunshine on Sunday. Sunday will be the transition day before that stronger system rolls into town as we head into Monday and Tuesday of next week. As far as the snow potential goes just for this weekend, we're looking at very light accumulations. Again, less than an inch, a dusting likely for a lot of us here across the state that get under one of those snow showers late tonight and early tomorrow morning. We've got the snow this evening through Saturday. And then the stronger storm system gets here by Monday and Tuesday. Initially on Monday, I think temperatures will be a little bit too warm for snow, so it's likely that we see some rain or a rain snow mix Monday, but then some uh, colder air moves in Monday night into Tuesday and then Tuesday morning could be the day that we'll be watching closely for more moderate snowfall here across portions of Iowa. It turns windy and much colder next week with, with a few more snow chances kind of mixed in there in the eight day forecast. Today's forecast. We're looking at highs, mid and upper 30s, still above average for this time of year. Tonight, temperatures drop only into the upper 20s under a cloudy sky with a few snow flurries. We're left with a few snow showers on Saturday. Again, most of that's going to be across northern and north central Iowa. Eight day forecast keeps us in the mid 30s all the way through Monday. And then the rain and snow gets here by Monday afternoon and evening, mainly just snow by Tuesday with colder temperatures. We sit in the 30s again on Wednesday, but colder air moves in highs in the 20s and if not teens by next Friday.